Hello? Hello? Hi guys, and welcome back to my channel, Cherry's Garden. Thank you very much for watching, and I'm back here today with my exciting product, and it, it is a bath salt. Homemade, handmade, 100% uh, natural. Right, okay, let's talk about bath salts. What are they? Why do you need the bath salts? Friend of mine told me, oh, bath salts are like a novelty. Is that what? A novelty. Yeah, you can put the bubbles, but if you don't want the bubbles, if you want to feel posh, you put the bath salt. Uh -uh. No. Bath salts actually has got quite a large, relaxing, great impact on your body. My background is from hospitality, and as you know, that's uh, standing on your legs, sometimes for 10, 11, 12 hours, and when I came home, my legs aching, and I mean like, ooh, bath salts, great relief, because I'm using Epsom salt and Dead Sea salt, they two uh, targeting different conditions. If your skin is dry, itchy, or you suffer from eczema, that sea salt is a choice for you, okay? If you suffer like me from aching muscles, you want to relax in your bath, Epsom salt, okay? There are two types I'm using, but you've got on the market large selection of other products like uh, Himalayan salt or any, uh, you know, combinations of all these free salts and there are already some fragrant uh, bath salts. However, I prefer to know what goes into my product. And uh, then I decided I will produce a bath salt. How does it look like? You've got this glass jar, which is 190 grams. Uh, I'm doing three different blends, which is one is uplifting, one is relaxing, and the third is soothing. The soothing blend is chamomile and uh, tangerine, uplifting is ginger and lemon, and relaxing is eucalyptus and lavender. Uh, this is only one of my, you know, to show you how my product looks like. You order it, you've got a tuck, you've got a warning tuck on the back, keep away from children and do not eat, just in case. You've got a little cute thingy here. Just so you know, I like to have a play with my products because the more love you put into that, the more en uh, you enjoy that and the uh, people, you know, end up. It's more satisfying for me if people come back to me and tell me like how surprised, amazed and exciting are to use my products. Okay, then I like a little bit of color. Again, if you go to the shop, uh, do you know what, you know, you've got your shampoo, creams, bath salts colored with? I would probably guess it will be E numbers, E this, E that, E50, 500, whatever is uh, bath. But I did actually quite extensive research, and believe me or not, in one of the local supermarket, I found the natural food, natural food coloring. You know, you just whack it there, put it few drops in, and you're gonna have. The yellow color like this. Okay. Now let's talk about essential oils. In my lemon and ginger uh, blend, the uplifting blend, I obviously put a few drops of lemon essential oil, which is 100% natural therapeutic grade essential oil. What is uh, lemon essential oil good for? Well, at least the aroma like uplift your mind, make you feel um, 
happy, uh, relax, energized. But it's also got a uh, very good uh, antibacterial uh, properties. Like if you diffuse it, it's pu purifying air. Uh, it's good like to kill any bacteria, but but also preserve. Uh, let's say if you got any hand cream, which is hundred percent natural, you want to preserve it. You put a couple of drops of lemon essential oil, and because because it's citrus essential oil, the natural uh, reaction is that they uh, uh, it will preserve that product. You need to do you need to preserve. Okay, next one is ginger. Uh, I know like uh, many of you probably know like lemon and ginger is the best combination like well not the best combination I would say but the combination that you uh, can't go wrong and it's true the ginger is one of the powerful essential oils uh, and in ca case like if you're wondering oh what ginger essential oil does uh, Ginger essential oils got very good impact on your digestive system. Also help to lift mood, like if you feel anxious, if you feel, you know, <coughs> depressed. Uh, ginger can uplift that mood. But also, uh, ginger is very good for uh, muscles, uh, for any tensions, aches, sprains. And that actually work hand in hand with that uh, Epsom salt and the Dead Sea salt, then actually enhance that sort of uh, experience you've got with the bath salt. Okay, then I'm selecting carefully the dry botanicals. How am I doing it? Go to the market, uh, watch the local farmer's market. Selected, I prefer unwaxed fruit, unwaxed citrus fruit, and untreated uh, fruit, vegetable, whatever I need. However, it's not always possible to find this, um, I would say, a niche sort of uh, uh, produce, I would say. And then what I'm doing is uh, selecting the fruit, make sure if it's waxed, I wash it few times to make sure to uh, uh, you know remove any residue anything uh, bad from uh, the skin then carefully prepare and dry I just show you like little samples this is my homemade dry ginger I've got little little bit of uh, orange zest in this one and some lemon zest in this one. Okay, once you, once I mix this together, it actually smells and look amazing. I just give you like like little sneaky peek. I don't know how good you would be able to see it, but have a look. And it's nice, it's not sticking together, it's got a beautiful yellow color and I can actually wait to use it tonight for Bob because I'm so excited. Okay, then you will receive necessary information leaflet which is, looks like that, you've got all the information inside which is uh, give you, you know, uh, like show you here on the one page, show you the selection of essential oils, what they good for uh, in case of skin, body and mind. You got a little talk, like just me to say, say to thank you. And you have your safety sheet with every single product you receive from me and it is for the reason because uh, using essential oils could be sometimes a, a bit uh, dangerous or you know me personally I would never ever uh, 
digest any essential oil uh, but it's only me some people doing that but you know hello I do what I like and I don't need to co copy anybody else okay guys thank you very much for watching if you fancy purchase one of my products you can contact me here you can find me me on Facebook you can contact me via my website which is www.jerris garden.co.uk and if you got any question you want some tips how to make your own uh, bath sauce or you don't just have a time and you want to purchase one 100% natural no artificial colors flavors uh, preservatives let me know and I'm sure we sort something out but until next time you will take care guys and I will see you later Bye.